pleasant and bone dry to start the work week today. Temperatures this afternoon reaching a high of only 74, but certainly comfortable. 51 was where we started early this morning. If anything, temperatures tonight could be a degree or two cooler than that, with a very dry air mass in place. We are in the mid-70s now across most of our viewing area. 76 degrees in Bluffton. It's 74 in Wapakoneta. 73 the temperature as we look to the south in Minster. Dew points in the 40s and 50s. Very low, quite a bit lower than last week. Recall that Thursday, dew points were in the 70s and 80s across west central Ohio. That was oppressively humid. Nothing like that to start things off this week. Although later in the weekend, by the weekend, we will notice an uptick in humidity. Mostly clear all across our local area. It will stay dry tonight and at least for most of the day tomorrow. But tomorrow evening, that will likely change for some of us. This cold front now cutting across the upper peninsula of Michigan back into Minnesota is delivering some showers and storms to that area. And as the front drops southeastward. We will see the chance of a shower, maybe a rumble of thunder in spots tomorrow during the evening shouldn't last long. The tropics, as we pointed out earlier, are definitely waking up. Hurricane Franklin in the Atlantic, 145 mile per hour winds with this storm. Luckily, it looks to stay to the east of the eastern seaboard. It may graze Bermuda. We'll have to see exactly where this tracks over the next couple of days. But as for Franklin, doesn't look to impact the eastern United States. Next up is tropical storm Idalia. And as we pointed out earlier, likely this will make landfall in Florida sometime Wednesday morning, perhaps as a category three storm. From there, it moves to the north and then to the east. I don't see any local impacts from this tropical storm system over the next several days with the southeastern United States. We're going to keep close tabs on that storm going forward. Again this evening, mostly clear. It's going to stay dry. Just scattered clouds late tonight. Sunshine during the day tomorrow. Later in the afternoon, clouds build back in. Here's 6 p.m. Some showers, a rumble of thunder off to the northwest with that front. 9 o'clock in the evening, the chance of a shower or a thunderstorm locally, but it doesn't look to last long as the front drops southeastward. We're dry and cool by Wednesday morning. Clouds Wednesday morning and then sunshine for our Wednesday afternoon. This evening, temperatures fall back into the mid-60s by 9 p.m. 66 in Lima, 65 Wapakoneta. Check this out. Late tonight, down to near 50 degrees in many places. The chance a few rural spots could be in the upper 40s briefly. And then tomorrow afternoon, temperatures climb back into the upper 70s for highs. Mostly clear, cool tonight. 50 degrees are predicted low in town. Sunshine tomorrow, then some clouds. Evening showers briefly possible are high before the rain, 79. Seven-day storm authority forecast for Wednesday. Clouds, then sun. A cool day. Highs only near 70. Down to 49 again for Wednesday night. Sunshine on Thursday looking great with a high of 75. 81 the call for Friday. Ample sunshine. It does look to warm up again by the weekend. 86 sunny on Saturday. Up to 90 degrees for Sunday. 91 the call for Labor Day. Jeff.